And today I'm going to do a quick video on how to make a simple clocking system for the security guards to track the time and date that they are on the, at a certain checkpoint. So let's right, let's jump right into this. Um, open Google Sheets. Right here, column A locations, column B R L C and column C we put the QR. So let's just have let's just do five samples p1 to p5 and under url open up google forms and call it um patrol check kings the option one just give it a name location copy the these locations p1 to p5 you can just control c to copy and then paste and you have the order of five values here make sure this is our multiple choice and then click the three dots here get pre-filled link click on p1 click on get link copy link go back to the spreadsheet paste on the url over here next we got to do an edit here under view form change it to form response with the capital r and right behind here take away this um this text the text here all the way until the end symbol and then it goes to p1 next what you could do is you can either copy and then paste on a new line and then change the value behind or the quickest way you can do is just fill down oops let's get that. okay click on the end here fill down and you can see the last value here it's just equal to the one here ones here next um let's we're gonna do the qr code um Go we'll search Google QR API. Over here, um, got to copy this statement. This link here. Go back to spreadsheet, and at the call and the view here, type equals image. Open bracket quotation mark paste that link here go back to the api copy this statement go back there paste that put an end symbol at the back go back api copy this state this parameter go back to excel paste it this is the size of the qr code let's just do 200 by 200 Put an end symbol, get back here, ch1 equals this parameter equals okay. Over here you have to have a quotation right, right quotation mark. Then um what you need to do is you need a value here b2. Then you put an end symbol b2 and close bracket oh no okay i'm sorry over here you gotta do an open bracket and a close bracket at the back okay yep there you go that generates the qr code you can what you can do is adjust the size here though and the width cool what you can also do is fill down um just drag this there you will see the value equals to b3 which is p2 okay next we're gonna paste the qr image into Excel, label it, 
then you can print this out and best to laminate it and then post and then stick it around the property that you want your guards to check in when they do their rounding. Um, here I'm going to just demonstrate two image. Um, before you do any scanning, I would suggest that you go to the settings of this Google Forms and um, make sure that this restriction is untick so that everyone with a uh, camera can just scan that code it will be easier that way and then um, under presentation click on show progress bar and untick on show link to submit and then respond save that okay right now there are no responses so I will just do a demonstration here using my other phone let's, let's go back to Excel okay I'm gonna scan this now open up um, camera just scan this and then it will take you a form and says your response has been recorded you can always change the form response over here This is where you can change, like, mm, checked in, completed. Over here, we have the response done. Then you can just click on the icon here, create spreadsheet. Then you can see basically the time spent and the location, the timestamp and the location. Yep, I hope this helps you guys.